we can rely on the Lord because He knows how to sustain us through life's hazards. Psalms chapter 37 verse 23 is where we're going to start today. This is Friday, May the 17th, 2013, and it's J.D. Martin's birthday. Happy birthday, J.D. Hope you have a great day. I'm assuming this is your 20th birthday. Then Saturday, the 18th, is Lois Evans' birthday and Christy Davis's birthday. May you two ladies have a wonderful, wonderful birthday on Saturday, the 18th. We can rely on him because he knows how to sustain us through the hazards of life. Psalms 37, 23. The steps of a good man are ordered of the Lord, and he delighteth in his way. Though he fall, he shall not be utterly cast down, for the Lord upholdeth him with his hand. We're going to talk about direction today. The steps of a good man are ordered by the Lord. I'm glad that if we're saved, sealed, and delivered, God has a plan, a perfect plan, a plan that doesn't fail, a plan of direction, leadership by the Holy Spirit of God in their life. It's amazing to me how this verse promises us God has sat down and purposely planned His will and His way for our lives, my life and yours. Each of our lives is indeed that important to His great eternal plan. For the ages. We're all important. Every one of us. Sister Lou in West Virginia is important. Sister Beulah and Spring Garden is important. Even Ken behind the camera is important. We're all important to God's work. We're all a part of that plan. And each of our lives is indeed important. The devil will lie to you and tell you that you're not important and that you're not significant. Yet God's clear. He, the steps of a person who loves him and obeys him are guided by him and directed by him and important to him. And who's qualified for the miraculous hand of God to guide and to direct their life? One who does it God's way. We have to surrender to God's way. It's not Burger King religion. It's a, a biblical faith and obedience that makes a difference. Not the one who does it their way, the one who does it God's way. Just obey His principles, trust His promises, and believe Him at His very word. Don't mess with a good man. <laughs> God's on His side, and don't you ever forget it. Don't mess with a good man, because He's with the Lord. Jeremiah 10, 23 says, O Lord, I know that the way of man is not in the, of himself. It is not in a man that walketh to direct his steps. O Lord, correct me, but with judgment, not thine anger lest thou bring me to nothing. It's a good thing God directs us. He guides us. He leads us. He spanks us and he blesses us. And the important thing is that we trust him every step of the way. And he will direct us. He's our strength for today and our hope for tomorrow.